Hey Michael, Andrew here, and I'm here to help you with your Blu-ray and HD TV purchase. Um, basically, I've given it a bit of thought, and I'm here to help you hopefully make the right choice and make your upgrade to HD that bit more enjoyable and easy for both you and Ted. So, um, what I'm going to do is just go through some recommendations on TVs and brands that I recommend. Um, and also talk about our setup. So, first of all, I just want to say yes, congratulations, you're about to step into the awesomeness that is HD and Blu-ray. Um, so be prepared to be amazed. Um, our setup here at home isn't quite full HD. We've got a 720p LG HD TV 42 inch and we also have a LG Blu-ray player with a 250 gig hard drive on it which basically allows us to record both standard def and HD TV channels onto the hard drive and we can watch them at a later date basically like a how you could record onto the VHS players or video players. Um, really, really handy. So if you can spare the extra cash and you do a lot of TV recording, I'd recommend picking up a Blu-ray player with the hard drive on it as well. Um, I wouldn't probably go out and purchase another LG TV to get, be completely honest. We've had our TV for two and a half years and while it's been great, it's still great. Um, we did have a few initial problems with it at the start, but I will say LG are phenomenal with their customer service here in Australia at least. Got straight onto the problem, fixed it, and we haven't had any issues since then. We also have an LG Blu-ray player as well, and that's been fine. Um, but eventually we plan to upgrade to a 1080p full HD TV and Sony would probably be the brand um, that I'd recommend and that I'd want us to get um, size wise 46 inch I reckon would be a good base size I've seen your living room in previous videos and I feel that that would be a um, nice size to experience some good home cinema viewing without being um, too big um, our 42 inch TV is fine but I probably wouldn't go any smaller than that in fact I wouldn't go any smaller than that um, 46 inch I'd recommend that size um, you said Ted looked at a Philips brand I can't give an opinion on that because I'm pretty sure um, Philips don't sell HD TVs in Australia or at least I haven't seen any but um, Sony would definitely be my top choice for both TV and Blu-ray. Then um, Samsung would be my other choice as they're pretty good as well. Uh, no idea if you're thinking of 3D TVs but I probably would give them a miss. It's pretty early in the technology and in my opinion probably not worth the investment at this point in time. Just a standard HD TV would be fine. Um, so yeah definitely Sony or Samsung and if you can afford it get a HD recorder onto the Blu-ray. Um, as for accessories definitely get an HDMI cable so you can attach that from the Blu-ray to the TV it just gives a solid digital signal um, and the best overall picture and sound quality so definitely get that. Um, they'll probably try and sell you a real expensive one you do not need an expensive one if you can pick one up for twenty to thirty dollars that does the job just as fine as one that's hundred plus dollars so don't be conned into paying an excessive amount for an HDMI cable oh, there's really no difference um, as for blu-ray movies themselves will they look great you're right comedy and comedy and drama you don't really need to upgrade them um, sci-fi and action on another words they look amazing on blu-ray um, especially sci-fi blade runner looks great especially the lighting really good transfer the 2009 star trek movie looks awesome avatar looks great and a lot of older sci-fi stuff looks really really good as well like planet of the apes and um, a lot of 80s sci-fi like the alien set and the thing and stuff like that um, 
but yeah hopefully this has helped and if you've got any more questions definitely let me know and I'll try and do my best to help you out again um, but yeah overall it's well worth the investment and um, yeah you're going to get some fantastic movie viewing from it so good luck to the both of you and thanks for watching